Welcome, Huck and Buck farm fans. My husband. So today we are going to order, or should I say Michael is going to order. Prepare to order. The first batch of chickens. And where are you ordering from? McMurray Hatchery. I personally I think, think, in, think. I think they're in Oklahoma. I think we're ordering too many. So we're not. So let, let's take a look at what the order is. Oh my goodness. So these would be the geese that we're going to order. Oh. Our Wi-Fi is slow. So we're planning on, because we're using it through the phone that we're now recording with. So we're planning <laughs> on having 12 geese, two males, and what would that math be? Really? 10 females. Go to the, I want the chickens. And some of them would be to harvest at a later date. Some of them would just be to stay on the farm. Here's our ducks that we're going to order. They're called Khaki Campbell Ducks. And we've got 12 of those. Two males and the rest females. Here mm, mm, mm. Now the, are our turkeys. But the turkeys I'm okay with because we plan on harvesting the turkeys. Get to the So we're going to have 12 turkeys. And they could be males and females. We'll probably keep at least one or two of the males as farm pets. You're showing them all the good stuff. Show them, yeah, that number. We're going to get 25 of a rare breed assortment chicken. Now, notice how he put emphasis on rare breed, as if that means anything. It, it's still 25 chickens. That's 25 chickens. That lay eggs every day. Boys don't lay eggs. Okay, but we don't know it how many. It could be 15 roosters and 10 hens. He knows when I start blinking my eyes that that means that we're doing the most. So that's the rare breed assortment. And then in addition to the rare breed assortment, we are getting what's called black giants. They are a larger size chicken. They lay brown eggs. We've got 10 females and two males, so two roosters. So basically what I'm saying, I know this is our first purchase and I know that we wanted to do this homestead, but I'm the financial mathematical person in the bunch. $600. I'm, it's not the cost. I can care, mm -hmm. not say I can care less. Because I know people are going to probably tell us where we can get free chickens and all that great stuff. So it's not the cost of the chickens, it's the work. You're in my, you're in my shot. Thank you. It's the work. Okay. That's Whether you have 25 rare breed plus the black giants, which is a guarantee of 10 chicks. I don't mean chicks like chickens, I mean chicks like sisters that are going to be laying eggs. <laughs> it's too much. Okay, so the fact of the matter is, when you break it down, whether you have 10 chickens or 100 chickens, it's the same amount of work. I, I, I'm still speaking and you're taking me off camera. It's the same <laughs> amount of work that you ain't going to be doing. I, yes, I will. We've already seen the first video of you doing absolutely nothing with Tierra because you were mm -hmm. still morning yawning mm -hmm. in the bed. Mm -hmm. And this requires work, rain. Why don't you watch your tone a little bit? This shine. Is, this, is this is family friendly video. <laughs> Snow, sleet, hail. Mm -hmm. It's too much. Mm -hmm. If I could run down into the garage to our refrigerator to show that we still have two dozen eggs sitting in our own refrigerator. We don't have any eggs in our refrigerator. You haven't eaten them. We don't have any eggs in our refrigerator. Oh, you probably threw them out because we were moving. Don't, don't with the semantics, don't. Well, it's not semantics, it's truth versus. So, to make this video a little shorter, we are actually taking a poll for everyone to let us know if that's entirely too many eggs. Because we're going to be selling those eggs to 
you because I'm we can't eat all of those so for selling them we need customers so who wants to actually purchase eggs because they're not gonna be for free I'm letting y'all know that from the job. organic grass-fed farm-raised local eggs no GMOs no antibiotics so that means so your first dozen is free right and are we delivering the eggs to people you're, no, they're coming here and they're getting them. So you have to come get the eggs, pay for the eggs, and I have to go out here and collect the eggs every morning. Go back to the screen. So that's the order, and we want to know from you guys, should we be ordering that many? Why are you clicking off of the screen? So I want to show them where that we're ordering from. Okay, I'll put it right there. Boom. All right, so I'm off to do our full-time job, which is real estate. I have to go show properties in Pennsylvania, but YouTube, Facebook for Huck and Buck Farms. Let us know if you think that that is entirely too many eggs for our first run. I think it is. Don't make me get some scripture. You're, I'm not even going to say anything. Anywho, click on the, we're going to post it on that Facebook page for people to Facebook go to. Facebook and we're working on getting it on. All right, on our YouTube page. On YouTube because we're trying to have a home to live in and right. electrician. Yeah, so don't make comments on my cabinets and the floors. We're, re we're renovating. So I told you guys I would be showing you the inside of the house, but not right now. The full scope, but you're seeing a little bit of this kitchen. Mm -hmm. It's frightening. Not frightening, it's just not our taste. We did get an electric fence for the dog yesterday, so I have to post a couple of those videos. So there's Kingers. Hi, King. That's my baby. He shook. He doesn't like the electric fence. But anyway, go to the page, comment, let us know what you think. All right, sorry for the long video, but welcome to. I need my people to look out for me. <laughs> Because I handle the, and I'll shut it down. And it's I, just too much work. It's just too much work, babe. All right. Night-night. Goodbye. Toodles.